On the heels of the Elite Knight set review, it was only natural that I looked at its predecessor, the Fluted Knight set. What I can say about this one is they tried, their heart was in the right place, but they definitely hadn't quite figured out how armor is supposed to work yet. It has a lot of the failings you see in conventional fantasy armor design, especially right here in the midsection, where we just have this giant gap where they couldn't quite figure out how you're supposed to actually connect the breastplate to the falls and the tacits, and that happens all the time in fantasies. You'll get this breastplate, then an open stomach, and then some sort of tacits. At least here they didn't do some sort of like loincloth armor situation, which always looks kind of iffy in my opinion. Uh, and now around here we have a decent looking helmet. The breastplate itself looks pretty good. Uh, you know, they definitely referenced the good armor here, but look, look at those legs. That's even worse than the faux brigandine. And then that arm is almost completely exposed in a very fantasy way where they think just a spalder and then a van brace is good enough. But it was a great starting point and one that definitely informed the later design armors as they figured out how armor should work.